Alright, so, hello and welcome back to the, another episode of Brave New World Blindfolded. Uh, this time I will obviously be going into the sealed cave. As would be expected from last time. Maybe I should show my equipment setup. Um. Skills, equip. Alright, now I should be showing you what my equipment is right now. I hope, anyway. The power glove on Sabin is important because it allows him to one hit KO the Ings, which I really want to do because Life Shaver can one hit KO Mog and Terra pretty easily. If uh, the Ings have lost more than 300 HP and they're not dead. So I want to kill them all in one shot. So I've kind of got it laid out so that Mog will use Dusk Requiem. Hopefully he'll use Snare, but if he doesn't, I can try to finish it off with Terra. Finish off the Ing, but I can never be sure. Cyan's Mind Blow obviously will be a one-hit KO, so no worries there. So let's get started. One, two, three... to count there rather than run halfway across the map. One, two. As you can probably guess, that place was super easy to navigate. Alright, here we go. Uh, so I never put much thought really into how I was going to figure out where my cursors were at the beginning, whose turn came up where. Probably just going to play the odds here. One left, all the way down. One up, all the way right. Yay, Demon's Bane! Something that will come in handy later, but certainly not now, considering nobody can equip it right now. Going left next time. Alright, so this is either Mog, Sabin, or Cyan. I'm gonna assume it's Sabin if the second. Uh, if, it, uh, if the command doesn't make any noises when I move the cursor around. Alright, so assume Sabin until further notice. I, I assumed it was Sabin, obviously, because he's faster. Alright. Dusk Requiem. Snare is always good. I won't have Terra do anything right now. Yeah, I, w I did that too early. Gotta get used to that timing again. Counterattack, which doesn't really help. Sorry if this noise is getting a little bit annoying, but hopefully Terra will finish off whatever that is. Which she happened to. Alright, so, skills. Terra's at the top. Oh right. I'm not in that. I I went down to equip at the start. So now I have no idea where my cursor is. Well, that's item, not skills. Alright, so I'm gonna... Yeah, it seems like I actually took no damage there. Ironically, uh, taking no damage is probably gonna throw me off more than it helps most of the time. Though it appears Sabin did get hit with some sort of status. Whatever it was, not really sure. 
I know there's Berserk in here, some Poison, Blind. That's why I'm just gonna try and remedy after every single battle. Alright, so I should end up in this little spot here. One, two. This time I'll remember the chest is straight down. One, two, three. All the way to the right. With my handy dash boots. One, two. And into this room. Or not. Oh wait, that's Snare. They actually kind of sound similar, I didn't realize that until now, but... I just haven't attacked the enemy on the top because it's more likely to be an undead creature. I, and I have all three of my characters on the player 2 noise. They're, they're all A, wait a moment, up, wait a moment, A. That, That'll input Blindbow for Cyan, attack this top enemy for Sabin, and for Mog I'll be in his menu still so I can get it out of it safely. Skills, Terra, Magic, Cure. I needed healing that time. Item. Should still be on Remedy. No status effects. Hopefully I don't start misinterpreting signs like I did in the Battle of Narsh, because that would be bad. Alright, this room looks like it'll be tricky, but it's not too bad, actually. Right one? Up one. So yeah, they don't start until I take one step to the left. I mean, right. Corrected myself, so I don't have to do it in the annotations later. One, two, three, one, two. Two of these. Two of these. Run all the way left. Continue running left. No real rush here, thankfully. One, two, three, four. I would have liked a battle there instead of where it's probably going to end up. Alright, so I exited the room and came back in so that the platform should be reset. Actually, in hindsight, it probably doesn't matter at all. But. One. Alright, so thankfully, you can actually take a step while it's transitioning, which kind of helps here. Well, at least I know I'm just holding right. Alright, you must be Mog. Terra's job is to hopefully try and finish off any Ings that get hit by cave in. Of course, it's completely luck-reliant as to whether that actually happens, but... If battles take long, it's probably those scorpion guys. I'm gonna start dispatching with Cyan now. Alright, gotta hold the run button, because the battle's over. Okay, now I can heal safely. Skills, Terra, Magic, Cure. And now, item. Really don't want any poison lingering on my characters, that would be a bad thing. Alright, grabbed a bat. Left and up until I get onto here. And by onto here, I really have no idea why I said it like that because that makes no grammatical sense. But, oh, what? How'd I end up in the lava? That's not good. Okay, how on earth did that happen? I must have skipped right over the spot. One, two, three, four, five. OK. 
okay. Oh, battle on the bridges again. Battle on the small bridge. Still, I have no clue how that happened. Alright, Terra will need to go. I'm probably just gonna fall straight in the lava again because... Pretty sure that battle got triggered in the wrong spot. Oh, fire, that's not good. And... Poison. And I gotta walk all the way across the bridges. This isn't going well at all. Okay, battle's still going. I bet something died of seizure, maybe, or... You're probably Mog. Ah, oh, whoops. Never mind. Missed the noise. And how could it have been Mog? He's dancing! <laughs> Makes no sense. Alright, now I should be over to the far end. Terra, magic, cure. It's increasing my chances of running out of magic points substantially. Must have been Sabin who was poisoned. If I fall in the lava again, I'm quitting and seeing what's happening. Alright, so I'm probably in the spot that I need to be in. Run straight down, should pause, run onto this type of bridge, run onto this bridge, and run onto that bridge. There we go. Probably. If I didn't do it properly, I would have probably run into the lava by now, so I can probably feel pretty safe about that one. Run out the door. Alright, down, all the way to the right. This part looks t tricky to navigate, but it actually ends up being really simple. Down. Right. So it's two of those. Now I gotta do uh, three down and lefts. That's the first one. Second. Just before the chest. Alright. You must be Mog. I hear some imp, but that's probably Sabin. Let's just leave Terran Reserve for now. Wombats? That's a weird one. Oh no, I just... No, never mind. Panic! Panic in the outhouse. <coughs> Alright. Skills... Terra, magic, cure. Yeah, I'm definitely starting to think Terra might run out of MP here. In which case, this will start to get. Oh, I'll have to start using dried meats, which won't be really all that difficult, but. I heard that Sabin got an imp proc in the last battle, for whatever that's worth. And the nice thing about this spot is you can literally just back out the same way you come in. Right? Up. Backwards, of course. 
Otherwise, I'm not sure how that would work. Right? Up. Right. Up. Alright, and now back to the lefts and ups. At least the encounter rate around here is really low. Left. Long way left. Alright. One. Oh, right in the middle of counting. I only have to do the counting steps thing like twice here. One second, my cat is... Casper, stop it. Not a good time. <laughs> You've got to be mad because someone else. I doubt those improcs can even do anything here, but... Tara, go for it. I want to avoid as much lifesaver use as possible. Another battle out of the way. Skills, Terra, Magic, Cure. I accidentally took a couple steps up, but I know where I am, thankfully, and I can't run up here. Uh, Terra got inflicted with something. Probably blind. If so, it's kinda lucky that she hit at the end there. Or maybe unlucky. Or maybe neither, considering it probably didn't affect the battle in any tangible way, shape, or form, but... Around here, into the cave... It looks like there shouldn't be, like, a little L-bend here, but there kind of is. One, two... Three, you just need to run straight right into the cave. Thanks for coming right after the steps this time. Much appreciated, battle. Uh-oh, why did I go up two there? You must be Mog. I think I might have gone too fast there. There's some more cave in. Who knows, maybe Terra will end up being useful here. Something just died. So this battle must have some undead in it. Nope, Terra did not kill an enemy, in fact. And this appears to be the end. Good. Then again, I say that all the time and get it wrong. Um, I, I'm not sure if I'm on item right now. There we go, save, yeah. Good thing I'm remedying after every battle, because I never would have noticed half of these uh, status elements that are getting put on me. I can't really make use of Terra's magic here, because... Could, Making a judgment call on whether to use MP or not is something that's generally probably going to be too complicated here to do. So if I am going to be using MP, it's probably going to have to either be with a character that can get MP back easily, or who can last the entire dungeon or something. I'm starting to almost think that I should have gone Vigor Terra at that rate, but... Alright, so yeah, almost forgot my route there. Gotta run up and right until I hit this spot, which isn't very far away. Moment of truth. Distant noise. 
Man, good thing it... Good thing I could hear that it was off in the distance. Okay. Mog. Unfortunately, if Mog does go first... It's kind of hard to tell. That sounded like Snare. That's definitely Cave-In. Going and wasting all my HP there. Oh, it's dead. Whatever it is, it's dead. Alright. Cure, magic, cure. Ah, that wasn't good. Lots of cure spells had to be used there. Item. Alright, finish running all the way down. One step up, all the way left. All the way up. I'm hoping I didn't go the wrong way there. I'll lose soon enough anyway. There's a chest right here. After that, the navigation gets a lot easier. To the left? Well, there's somewhere I can go left, but I think that battle might have been on the first step, so... It doesn't tell me much. And it's Mog again. How inconvenient. Surprisingly, Cyan beat Sabin to the punch. That was definitely Cave-In, so attack. Oh, whoops. That's not good. Depending. More cave in. That could be good or bad depending on what fight it is, but. Oh, didn't even have to time it because it's over. Skills Terra, Magic, Cure. Took no damage apparently. Alright, so I'll finish running to the left. There's my nice treasure chest full of X-Potion. I actually remember this one. I should probably be on the bridge, so it doesn't matter which way I start running. counter-attack. Good to sort those things out, because otherwise I might get confused. Terra, go for the kill. Terra can't really do a whole lot right now. I put her in the back row because she's a little bit too squishy to be in the front at the moment. And she'll never be able to one-hit KO anything in here, which is what I really, really want to aim for, so... Skills, Terra, Magic, Cure. Oh, that's the end of her MP. There was a little pause there. So that's how I knew. Seven got put on something. So now I gotta delve into my dried meats. No biggie. I've got plenty. I grinded up every single spell on the belt, just in case I'd need it eventually. But. That also gave me a boatload of gill for the moment. 
still not as much felt grinding as I needed to do in my LLG though. I didn't want to get super over leveled while doing that, but I figured I'll never learn those spells otherwise if I don't belt grind form a bit, so. Because otherwise it would throw my stats off. And while I'm not going to go super uh, far out of my way to level up the stats perfectly, because I don't really feel it's necessary, I can start going up and right now. I'm not going to go out of my way to level up every stat perfectly because it's really not necessary. Going right next. But I don't want to just throw them away like that, so... Might have been too slow there. You gotta be Mog. There's a cave-in on my side. Definitely not good. Uh oh. Somebody's at low HP. Let's wait in the morph menu for the moment. Prevent some of that seizure damage, hopefully. Dang it. Messed it up. There. Hopefully that'll finish off the battle. Oh, another cave-in. Wow, somebody might die from this. If the same person got cave-in twice, they're probably gonna die. Is that the end? Can I tentatively say that it's the end? Okay, good. I had to use a lot of dried meats there, so I can tell for sure that that person was the one who got cave -end. They They must have eaten both and not died. That's the only way I can see how that would have worked out. Either that or the person with region ate the first one. Cyan, that is. Pretty sure this bit just works out nicely. I can take one step to the left to get on the staircase. And then one step to the right. Was it? Uh oh. Alright, so let's start trying to go up and right. See if I can fall into the corner that I was originally using in my uh, BFLLG. There we go. Alright, gonna fight the ninja here just for kicks. This is going to be a whole day fest. Cyan's in the front row because of the back attack. Uh, Water Edge, that's not a particularly good start. I, Berserk will make this guy a chump. Uh, Caven will work nicely. Wombat will murder his face off. Yeah, there's Caven. Dispatch is two times damage, so I'm not entirely worried about this. But it could theoretically go wrong. He hasn't banished himself yet, so yeah, he's dead. There are a couple ways that battle could go wrong, but a lot more ways that that battle could go right. I'm guessing Terra may have died there. I'm right next to the save point, so let's not waste the phoenix down on my most useless character. <laughs> um. All 
Alright, hit the wall. And now, the room. There we go. There's my chest full of... I don't even think I got the chest in my test run, so I have no clue. Okay. So, that's the end of that segment. Half an hour, but it went pretty well. Yep, Terra died. What a shame. It's horrible, horrible shame. Um, tense. Here we go, tense. So now Terra's MP is all back, everyone's right as rain, Savin's probably learned Aura Bolt. So yeah, save. Why did I save state? That was pointless. See you next time.